Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 will be launched later this year. We have seen some leaks already with the codename SM8250 which directs towards Snapdragon 865. The important announcement from the Snapdragon mobile platform is that it will come with a built-in 5G modem. Apart from that nothing much has been revealed. However, the tweet from this user indicated that this chipset will come with an external 5G modem and if that turns out to be true, then we might see two variants of Snapdragon 865 that is one with inbuilt 5G modem and the other with external 5G modem. If we see, there are not many 5G phones available in the Indian market. Also, the 5G network is not available. So this is the preferred market where Snapdragon 865 with external 5G modem can come, where chipsets will be available without 5G modem. Also, this will decrease the price of the chipset and also the price of the smartphone. But the markets such as United States and South Korea where the 5G adoption is greater is where the Snapdragon 865 with inbuilt 5G modem is preferred. The integrated modem will provide manufacturers with extra space which can be utilized for more battery or better cooling system. Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 featured X50 5G modem and for Snapdragon 865 it will come with X55 5G modem. And the other thing that Qualcomm has confirmed is Snapdragon 5G mobile platform will use the second generation sub 6 GHz and MMware antenna modules. With that, you will have the all new power saving 5G technology that increases the battery life of 5G smartphones. The next good news is regarding Samsung. To know everything, let's dive in. Every manufacturer tries to find new ways to implement selfie camera and make entire front surface available for use. In that process, we have seen new and improved displays with various kind of notch. But one manufacturer, and you guessed it right, it's Samsung, which found the best way for the current state of technology. Few weeks ago, the vice president of research and development division of Samsung said that Samsung would be close to creating a full screen panel without any kind of notch. So with this technology, every sensor and the front camera will be underneath the screen, making it notchless and beautiful. How this technology works is when the front camera is not in use, the hole will become invisible just like the in-screen fingerprint scanner we are used to seeing. So you got the idea right, but still it is unknown if this is how it will work, it's just a rough idea that we have. Also the Korean giant has filed a request for a patent relating to a wrap around display which extends beyond the edges and continues on the back of the phone. So this is it for now, if some more updates are available I will let you know. With that being said, I am Satish and see you in another video, peace out.